But to go to uh, George's point about Mike Castle, Republicans have a real problem because to win some of these seats, such as Delaware, they need moderate candidates like Mike Castle. But look at that race in upstate uh, New York, the special race. election uh, for the House, where the Republicans nominated a moderate Republican, uh, Didi Scozafava. Um, and then a, the Conservative Party in New York State put up a right-wing candidate supported by the teabaggers. That right-wing candidate is cutting into the moderates' votes, and the Democrat is ahead in a district that is very you Republican. Know, That's a real challenge long-term for the Republicans. Hey, Can they bring, nominate moderates? He brings up an important point. Uh, Stan Greenberg and James Carville did a study this week of the Republican base of voters. And one of the things they found out, this hardcore part of the base is in a world unto its own. Uh, right now, the, the, the tea bag movement, and you know, they're sort of driven by the idea that President Obama and the Democrats have a secret plan to impose socialism. Uh, I can't help but think a lot of this stuff is, is exaggerated in terms of calling it tea baggers and, and all that stuff. Look, this country saw this summer an awakening, if you will, an August awakening of people at town halls coming forward. Republicans and independents and some Democrats saying, wait a second, we're not liking the way they're doing it right now in Washington. That is creating, I think, something of a wave that perhaps if Virginia and New Jersey uh, seem to be going Republican, may lead to something serious in 2010.